Hey everyone, my name is Kiddo Crew, also known as Brandon, and I'm going to be talking to you about all things chaos. On screen is an incursion mission, or 1,000 points of my Nightlords versus a Novak Necron list, just so there's something visual what, to what I'm saying. So upon returning to Warhammer 40k, uh, just before the announcement of 9th edition, I found a lot of information out there ranging from competitive lists to new lore that absolutely inspires me, but nothing really for specifically what I was looking for in chaos. Uh, Chaos has been known for quite a while to be not so much a standalone list, but souping was very, very big, very thematic for Chaos, but just not my style. A lot of the souping lists favor one of the four gods, Korn, Nurgle, Zinch, and Slanesh, depending on what t style of play you're going for. But again, nothing for the standalone factions of just Chaos Space Marines. Uh, there's even some channels that are dedicating all of their gameplay to these specific legions led by the specific chaos gods a good example of that is a actually a very recent youtube channel out there called the red path that focuses on corn and all things corn and berserkers uh, so this is where i come in this video is going to give you a brief overview of each legion and it's going to be pretty much things that i was wanting to see on the internet that i just didn't see available i'm going to give you a quick background on each legion in this video, who's currently leading it and what they're known for, uh, who their probably preferred enemy is lore-wise, and uh, later on I'll be covering thematic lists and uh, strong combos for each army depending on what rules are out when I get around to making those videos. For now, let's see who we're working with. The first legion we're going to cover is the Black Legion. It's originally known as the Luna Wolves, later the Sons of Horus, and now the infamous Black Legion. They sort of represent all of Chaos Undivided as a single entity. They're not aligned to any Chaos Gods specifically, but they definitely follow all four of the Chaos Gods. Its current le leader is Ezekiel Abaddon, also known as Abaddon the Despoiler. He's blessed with gifts from each of the Chaos Gods and carries a demonic relic blade. Uh, the army is very thematic and has a lot of synergy with all the different gods and units within it. It's a very come-all take-on list and are sort of the poster boys for Chaos Space Marines as a whole. Comparable in that way to the Smurfs, also known as Ultramarines, for being the poster boys of the loyalist versions of Space Marines. Um, their most hated counterpart would probably actually be the Custodes, who, even though they're not direct Space Marines, uh, the Black Legion was direct contention with the Emperor himself, not any of the other legions. So the Custodians would probably be the more most accurate hated counterpart. The Black Legion symbol is an eye with a eight-pointed chaos star known as the Eye of Horus. Next up we have the Alpha Legion. Alpha Legion is said to have lost half their primarchs. And I say half because one they were twins. One of them, Primarch Alpharius, is said to have been killed, with his brother Omegon taking on the name of Alpharius to now lead them. Alpha, Alpha Legion is the sneakiest of the sneaky boys. No one does espionage or infiltration quite like them. Their most hated faction was probably the Ultramarines, as they're a direct violation of the Codex of Sardis in every way. They do not really stand up for up, for up fighting tactics and... Um, Cohesion, they're very much about any means necessary to get the job done efficiently. Uh, their specialties make them not only flexible, but very devastating when they finally do come into action. Their symbol is a multi-headed hydra, which also represents their propensity to attack from multiple directions. The Iron Warriors, Siege, Siege, Siege. The Iron Warriors are led by their primary Perturabo, who's currently believed to be a demons, uh, demon primarch, to my understanding. Uh, he's a extremely methodical and was a very devout sp space marine primarch, very much into siegecraft, used to work alongside with the Imperial Fists in that regard, and would probably be, be considered their equal and counterpart and also most hated enemy. Many of their surviving members have replaced their organs and limbs with metal, sort of becoming a, an embodiment of their credo, which is iron within, iron without. Their symbol is a metal skull atop a chaos star. The word bearers 
I know I'd be severing, said I'd be covering legions that aren't really devout to specific gods, and this still falls in line with the word bearers. They worship the entire pantheon of chaos gods all together. Their primarch, Lorgar, was the first to fall to chaos because of one of his chaplains. We'll cover that later, though. The word bearers even when loyalists would convert worlds before making their next move. This is just a guess, but I would think that their most hated faction is the Sisters of Battle, who are the only ones who really come even close to the level of zealotry in their beliefs. Second to maybe the Dark Angels. Their symbol is a flaming skull on a book. I am Batman. Sorry, I had to. So the last up is the Night Lords. They're one of the few legions who currently have a confirmed dead Primarch. Conrad Kurz let himself be assassinated to prove to the Emperor and all of the, the Imperium that might equals right. The masters of terror tactics and hit and run assaults, the Nightlers relish in mental and terror tactic warfare. Currently without a leader, they're just a broken husk of their former selves, barely more than a band of criminals. Their most hated faction would probably be the D Dark Angels, as their Primarch Lionel Johnson was one the one to cause a nearly lethal blow to Conrad Kurz during the Horus Heresy. The symbol is a skull with bat wings, and as a personal note, this is the faction I play the most, as that's what my 13-year-old heart decided on just over two decades ago, and man, does that make me feel old. So that's really all there is for this video, short and sweet. Uh, it's something that I just want to start putting together and uh, see what you guys think. If you know of any channels that are dedicated to any of the factions uh, that I just listed above or any of the four chaos gods, hit me up in the comments below. I know about the Red Path, and I'll probably put a link to him in the, in the description. Until next time, DTFE.